Hello everybody, Speedrun here. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to fix this error right here. So this is an unsupported version of a map for different RAG XCs, for example. Usually if you use 20, 20 below, you might get this error or 2021. I'm not, I don't know exactly, but for example, I use RAGXC 2018 and I get this error when I go to like a new map that I have added to my server. So, uh, loading fail is a RSW, this one, and this is a Sonic map. And now I'm going to teach you how to fix. So, I will show you here very quickly. So, I have my backup. Okay. and I will replace so now I'm going to open the game and we should be able to access the map without any issue let me show you so I'm going to use this character right here all right so now we need to go add warp one at VRSN Okay, so now I have entered the Sonic room. Okay, everything's working fine. Can you see that? And all of these 3D models in the map, they are actually RSM2. And this uh, 3D model format will not actually work in in the rag or the rag axis okay so now that everything is working fine as you sh i show you here let's go ahead and start fixing things okay how can we actually make it work and in an easy way so i need to go to where i can find this map for example and that's uh iro let me open the GRF. So if I go here and add one, add RS. Let me see. Let me double check the name. Ah, okay. One V R S N. Okay. So I should be able to preview it. All right. This is what I have. This is the. This is the Sonic Room. Okay. If you see to extract resource, you will see that everything here is RSM2. Can you see that? RSM2, RSM2. And old RAG axis cannot actually load that. And a lot of people been asking, like, how can I actually do this, right? Now I'm going to teach you a very nice way to do this and clean way, okay? Let's open our lovely Brow Edit 3. This is very, very helpful right now. And right here in the same location, I'm going to create a new folder called Sonic, okay? Let's do this very, very properly. Now, when I open Brow Edit 3. All right, I'm using this version right here because I found to be very stable. However, I haven't tested the very, very last one, but one of the versions in between, I, I found a bug. So if you want to use the same just to prevent any type of issue, you can downgrade. All right, so I'm going to global settings and I want to make sure um my data iro okay so here's my data iro i want to bring it up and up okay so right at the top which is good i'll save it and i am going to open the map so file open one at b r s n Okay, so this is the map. 
and this is the sonic room map okay so i'm going to um drag to the center here okay and i'm going to click on objects so you see there rsm2 and rsm2 everywhere i click here is not rsm2 so this in particular this 3d it's fine here is also normal but let's see what, what else you click here is rsm as well let's find more rsm2 models i think those in the bridge here see these ones are rsm2 and we need to get this fixed i think this as well yeah all right so how do we actually make this in a very easy way i go to file and then export to folder okay here we have our sonic map i need to click here browse sonic map and uh, sonic map and hit ok so it's very important that you browse and hit ok so it really registers here a device you might have some issues so now you have the entire list of your map and here you probably can locate our sm2 models just like this okay and already with the textures and everything is perfectly select i'm gonna click export okay now we have our data and our clean model here there are no um minimap for this so actually you need to if you want to add the minimap you need to so i'm gonna rename this okay and then i'm going to add this here okay but should be under texture so uh let me rename this one again i want to make sure it matches the name think so and then here i go and add a folder called map and then there should be something called map here and the the, the map so this you have to extract separately and there's one more thing you need to extract separately which is uh so let me just wait now i mess it up here but, uh let me extract again so extract okay and then select okay so now we have the minimap which is just blank in this case as well um there is something called um hat effect so, so if i go hat effect uh so if i just put add here one add rsm so you see that there is the effect okay and this effect is responsible for uh this animation right here i will show you right now so there is animation here okay so if you ask me how this animation is works uh it's from here okay and um you cannot preview what's written in here right now but if you extract you can and then there's a decompiler you can decompile and see and understand that this is files okay uh, let me show you really quick really i think it's worth to, to see it. so it's located in lua effect tools and one add okay so let's do this properly um so if i go back to my server folder Okay, so I have my okay, I'm like, no, sorry, client, and then I have data, and then I have Lua files, Lua files, effect tools. Oh, it's not here. All right, I'll use this as an example. So I open this lab, and then you can see it's picking this bmp and creating an effect above it with these parameters basically that okay so that's the hat effect 
and this is made with a effect that is the, the smoke effect anyway now that we have the map here we can actually close pro edit we don't need pro edit anymore for now and um let me see where did i save uh, yeah sonic map okay so let's make a new grf file new grf okay here i'm going to add all of this and then go file save and add this to this location for now and let's add sonic grf okay amazing so we have created our grf here with the sonic map and all the resources required okay can you see that everything is here and everything is working fine the effect is not here as you can see because i haven't imported the hat effect uh dot look anyway let's double check the extract resources everything is here i see and here are the rsm2 files okay if you want to duplicate this you can duplicate this grf just in case something goes wrong so you can uh, you can add this and say rsm2 backup okay make sure your grf is uh, updated so you have this option to right click and downgrade map okay so you downgrade the map look what just happened let me save here so now that i downgrade the map to avoid the error Okay. and did you see the magic right here everything has became rsm dot rsm dot rsm you see and still preserving the transparency and pga files like this and this is a very powerful thing made by tokay and i appreciate tokay for that so now your map is already able to load in game okay uh just like i showed you before and this is pretty much it however there is another thing you can do if for example your map just had one rsm2 let's open the backup one now there's another powerful feature here okay let me find here rsm2 file if i for example right click here i can convert to rsm1 with animation or flat it's rare that animation will be kept so i suggest you go to the flat version and avoid any issues in the future anyway you can try with the animation if you want there is in this case is no animation anyway right so you you go ahead and just use the flat okay i hope this video was useful for you and i'm sure it will actually be useful for someone and speed run staying here subscribe because i will bring tutorials on regular online time to time and i wish you the best of luck bye bye